Welcome to the Monthly Economic Report. The first time I've ever looked at it in all seriousness. Um, yeah. So, Pirate Strongholds. I first started doing them way... Oh, Jesus. Playlist. Let's go check it out quick. Um, Pirate Strongholds. All right. Let's see the videos. Uh, I first started doing it in... 2019 spring of 2019 uh, using Armageddon's of all things oh my god I was such a new back then um, back then CCP wasn't tracking it in the mer uh, this is the first time March 2021 that they first started metric uh, there's a metric for it uh, they they didn't even have it in other or miscellaneous in the Isson faucets before then. So two years after I started, um, and I started because I started quite early on into it because it was annoying for the upwell owners to get the notifications. It was, ah, so I finally was like, screw it. I'm going to start bashing these things. And I started and at the time you would see a lot of five jumps away fobs you'd be like oh wow that's weird and you just really didn't know why there was there was confusion as to how much dps you needed the forum troll post there was only one and it was like you need 1500 dps and blah 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 blah, blah. and it was just disinformation like you wouldn't believe um and I don't want know the why the person was lying his face off. It, it was just, it was the mar, the the industry of fob bashing, uh, pirates from the bashing had not matured at all, and it was somebody trying to keep it all secret to himself. And I thought that was pretty silly. Anyways, I looked into it, lost a bunch of Armageddon's doing it, tried nesters. <laughs> Oh, no. And then discovered that Triglavians were the best way, and I went to shacks and haven't looked back. I've tried other things, but... And you see me doing it solo for the... For those poor individuals who are getting notifications for their upwell, and they're way in the back of beyond, and they've only got one or two or three accounts, and they really can't afford Le shacks, and they want to do them on cheap. So I look into that for them. Um... There are ways to do it with Myrmidons. I've seen people do it. It's fun. Uh, but yeah. The Myr. Profits. The profits have increased from when they started met doing the metric by five times. 500% it's increased. All right. And that's because there are some now doing it to max out the reward at 800 million per not a lot of them, but I've seen it, and it's scary as crap. I knew this day would happen. Like, I knew it was going to happen. There was just, it's just too much ridiculous isk faucet. It was, it's just, I can go around with um, the optimal is 10 pilots, and you get 300 million isk total. Per fob, takes you 15 minutes with three shots. That's an insane amount of isk. It's just bananas but in the larger scope of things it seems minuscule right and even if i did the maximum i could let's say i spent every day conservatively i was able to no knock over four fobs and that's what i claim that on an average day even during the weekend i could probably do four fobs average per day every day right because you know i'm a hardcore player i'm not a casual player i play every day you know you know tr's here for hours there maybe more and four times 300 say say i was able to get 10 po I, I hardly ever do I, I try to bring friends in because it it's worthwhile so that's 1.2 billion isk straight to the wallet um every day and you do that 30 days and i alone am contributing 
36 billion. So let's say back in the day, March 2021, me and a few other guys were doing this, and some of them would post on Zkill. It totally spams out your Zkill and says, oh, you're a dangerous person. And it's like, lol. Um, and I don't do it because it, I don't like cluttering up my Zkill with PVE. It just seems like you're padding. It, it you know. So, yeah. So, 36 billion a month and 577 billion divided by. I just completely forgot my number. <laughs> divided by 36. So that's 16 players like me, or groups of players like me, who feel, yeah, 6 to 10. No, I mean, sorry. Let's say an average of 10 pilots per for, to get the optimal. Let's not get crazy here, right? So that's 16 people like me who are doing both Garistas and Blood Raiders across the universe in high sec for this stuff, right? Now, we're not sure if the payout includes the low sec ones. It probably does. The grist is low sec. And I think it's in null sec too. And those are big payouts. So those are like, ooh, wow. Um, well, maybe the loot's not counted. Maybe maybe the pirate reward payout is similar. So I don't know. So I'm going to assume it is. And we'll back away from that number. So, so 16 players out there, including, say, the null sec um, people and the low sec, uh, but it doesn't show up on agency, so it's not easy to find, so it's lesser, right? And I think there's only, like, three in existence at any one time. Anyway, so I don't know how many at any one time are in existence in high sec. Holy crap. Sometimes I can find 12. I think the maximum I've found is maybe... 15 fobs in my local area um that's on a good day um anyway so there's 60 players out there doing what i do exactly right 10 let's say 10 pilots each so that's 16 players in the mix if it jumped by 500 percent, that would mean that there's now 80 teams out there doing what i do but there's it's not It's not. Um, if we're up to 2.5, which we are currently last month, 2.5 divided by 0.8. Say, wait, I'm doing it wrong. I suck at math. Let's bring it over here. Okay, so 2.5 trillion divided by 800 million equals Okay, so say say you had say you had a team that was doing just just on paper hypothetically just a, a thought experiment. Say if you had somebody who I saw who was running forty eight clients and who was maxing out at eight hundred million. What if they were doing it? Every day, he, that person would need to roll over approximately a hundred fobs a day. That's impossible. That would that would take a hundred hours, right? So, let's say somebody was doing it for eight hours a time, right? And eight hours a time would mean. Sorry, uh, I'm probably doing this completely wrong. Uh, no, that's not it. Um, 100 per day divided by get <laughs> 24 oh shit 104 whoops 104 divided by 23 right so you would have to do 4.5 per hour which is impossible um Uh, 
where do I go from here with my math? So say five per hour, right? So I have to do five per hour. The maximum you could do if you're traveling, right, is probably take, say, 50 minutes travel to the next one. It takes you 15 minutes to blow it up. That's half an hour, right? So you could only do two. Let's be more exact. 4.5. So you could only do two. So for every hour of the day, there would have to be this many fobs blown up. You could only do two, right? And that's if you were pushing hard. And that doesn't include scouting time, right? So let's say, including scouting time, well, these people have so many scouts, it doesn't, it doesn't take them long at all. So let's say two. So say, say there was two going full time 24 seven, that's impossible. So let's say they did it for eight hours at a time, or no, let's say they did it for six hours at a time, right? No, no, let's say eight. So what if they did it for eight hours a day, right? That seems reasonable for a obsessed um, autist. Let's do so two of them. That was so that would be times three during the day. So that'd be six of them. So there have to be six of them going full on every day, and they would make two point five trillion a month. So all it takes, all it would take, like seriously, all it would take would be six of them and they could do as much as currently is going on. And I think there's maybe one or two or three of these people, right? Like say half, right? Let's say half no, let's say there's only, like, I, there can't be more than two of them, right? That it's not take, taken off for the bots yet, right? It's crazy that it hasn't. It's just blowing me away for this long. It just hasn't because of the, it's just stupendous amount of ISK just waiting there be, to be had. It's zero sum, right? There's only a maximum amount of fobs in, in the entire universe at any one time in high sec. So it's not like you could do, go it infinitely. It's zero sum. And we don't, like, this is not, this is only calculating hypothetically 2.5 trillion for the current uh, last month. That's only assuming that, uh, hypothetically on paper, that that's the maximum you could do. There are way more potential. Like, way more, if you had six of these guys cranking it out, 100%, you wouldn't even be tapping the potential for this. Because the more they do it, the more they respawn. So they could just keep going. So it is, in effect, I guess, infinite, in that during that time, if they scouted just a little bit, they'd find more, and they, they, they could keep on going, right? It's, you know... As long as somebody over on the other end of the exact galaxy is punking the fobs because, it, you know, it's a random distribution. So as long as everywhere is equally being ganked, you know, the, the pirate strongs are being blown up, it will generate more and more. So you could do this an infinite amount of times and over and over and over again. There'd be a lot of wasted time as the bots with 50 slashers running around the universe... Uh, kind of oversaturate and kind of bump into each other and the inefficiency set in but it's going to be there right so we're looking at two maximum that are doing this right i'm just going to assume two maximum so the rest of it the rest of us doing them you know at lesser like we're not doing we're not getting 800 million we're getting like you know approximately 300 million i'm getting uh, 210 million at the moment but you know the rest of us doing it when there's there's quite a few like there's probably a dozen that i know of in my area that i know of right maximum so you know we're getting it done 
you know, all over the universe, including the Garistas in, in Caldari space and stuff. But just imagine just the explosion that can happen in the Isk faucet when there are six of them. And then as soon as people figure out what's going on and what a ridiculous Isk faucet this is, it's just going to take off. Right? Probably plateau at maybe 12 trillion, right? On the highest, let's say 10 trillion. That that can be done in 23 hours. I mean, you know, nobody's superhuman. And there'd be too much competition. It would saturate the market and people would give up because, you know, you'd be fighting over freaking the, the fobs. It would just be mental. So we went from March 2021, it went uh, 0.6, 0.5, 0.5, 0.7, 0.8, 0.7, 0.9, 0.8, 0.7, 0.6, 0.5, 0.8, 0.9, 0.7, 0.8, 1.1, 8, 0.8, 1.1, 1.